So as I am returning this 20 some dollars worth of food that was left outside my tent this evening, I'm always fortunate in that the manager of the company where I usually produce my food is kind like that. She recognizes the immoralness of people who want to hold power over me. But the crazy thing is that as I go through the line, and I'm very apologetic for the waste of time that these people have really caused both me and the people of the Dollar Tree, I come back to my tent to find that someone has placed food of which I'm highly allergic to on my tent, which tells me that they are the liars of America listening to my channel and participating in psychological, psycho-emotional abuse of me, of we are in power over you. You're not. Your Christmas gift, if that's what you call it, was not something I needed. Between the 20 seven some dollars that was utilized by possibly these two different people I could have produced for myself a new warm shirt you see if you're trying to help someone who is impoverished the best thing you can do is ask them what they need and how you can help but the abusers in America always want to be in power over their dollars which is perfectly well but you don't have the right to take away the power of someone's choice the power of their privilege to decide, the power of their knowledge of what they need, and the power of having cash to do something to succeed. A person like me who is allergic, highly allergic to chocolate, does not need to be abused by someone who is a chocoholic. And openly, there aren't many people who need to eat sweets and treats to keep healthy of heart, mind, soul, or body.